How's it going everybody? It's Tim from Do Coffee and Smoke. Now, we recently came back from a trip to Northern Ireland. We travelled all along the north coast. And man, I love that place. There's a whole otherworldly quality to it. You can really see why shows like Game of Thrones are filmed up there. Now, of course, we sampled the local foods and had Irish stew, which is just so, so good. So I couldn't resist when I got home, having a go myself and working out my own recipe. I've got one I'm really happy with. Right, before we get into this recipe, I want to show you some highlights of our trip. See what I mean? Place is amazing. Now for today's recipe, we have about a kilo of lamb shoulder with the bone left in, it's an added flavour. About an average size onion, a couple of small to medium carrots, about two or three medium sized bay leaves, and about four medium sized potatoes. I'm also going to use my blowtorch, a slow cooker, and a couple of tablespoons of our dude coffee and smoke barbecue rub. Okay, let's get started. First up, we're going to finely chop the onion and the carrots. We're also going to roughly chop those potatoes to roughly an inch squares. Right, let's pop some olive oil in the frying pan and fry off those onions and carrots. We don't want to brown them, but get them nice and translucent and softened. Fine, if you don't fry off onions and carrots before they go in the slow cooker, there's always a bit of a slightly raw taste at the end of cooking. So this is completely worth the effort. Okay, so we've got our lamb. Now we're not going to rub the lamb, because what we're going to do is hit it with the blowtorch. If we rub it first, there's a chance we're going to burn those spices. So what we're going to do is give the whole joint of lamb a light sear all over the blowtorch. Obviously, we're not trying to cook it at this point, we're just trying to add some flavour that would be missing because we're not cooking with fire. Okay, everything ready to go, let's fill that slow cooker up. We're going to start with the carrots and onions, and then layer on top with the potatoes. And then let's pop that lamb in on top. And then, to fill some of that gap we're missing by not having smoke from a wood-fired oven, we're going to add three tablespoons of our barbecue rub. Then pop in two or three bay leaves and about a cup of water. Now, the total cook time for this is about six and a half hours. In the first five and a half hours, we're going to set our slow cooker at low. We're going to pop it up to high for at least the last hour. So what we're looking to do is get the temperature up for that last hour and just melt the fats, make the meat extra tender and moist. Okay, about six and a half hours ago we started cooking this and now it's ready. Can't wait to give it a go. I've bung some soda bread in the toaster to go with this, just to soak up that broth. Can't wait to give this a go. That slow cooked lamb just falls apart in your mouth. And the flavours are so simple and clean. It's really delicious. And it's so tempting to thicken up that light brothy sauce. But do you know what? It's so, so good as it is. It's a really nice excuse to grab some soda bread for dunking. So hey, if you like this video, click like and if you enjoy what we do click subscribe we do a fresh video about once a week and try and bring fresh interesting ideas to the kitchen that are super easy to do have an awesome week